Now here's weather. <laughs> <laughs> Our own little TV magic tricks. She's got the hang of it. I like her. There you go. Uh, no. <laughs> it's broke. It's, it's bro broken. It's broken. <laughs> Oh, there we go. I can do that. There you go. Do that. One. <laughs> okay, Carlene. There's a lot of bright colors on that map behind you. Yeah, that means it's still a little warm out there, yeah. Jesse. Yeah, we're still feeling that heat. So we got 80s right now. We're seeing 70s and 80s, 70s along the coast. You also have 77 degrees right now for Poway, but it's 80 degrees in Escondido. Also talking about 87 degrees right now for Borrego Springs, where the high, uh, high today was at 90. So feeling the heat out there. And now we're going to go in the opposite direction for the rest of the week. 12 miles per hour out of the west right now for Ramona, out of the west-northwest, that's at 10 miles per hour for downtown, and out of the southwest for Fallbrook. So it's starting to talk about more of an onshore flow when it does come to our winds. So we're going to have those westerly winds really winning out over the next few days. We had Santa Ana winds that picked up earlier today. That's part of the reason why it was warm out there, warmer than usual by about 10 to 15 degrees west of the mountains. Current wind speed in Chula Vista is 11 miles per hour, 12 miles per hour right now for Campo, and also 10 miles per hour for Escondido seeing around Camp Pendleton picking up to about 20 miles per hour. So for your overnight lows, mainly in the 50s as we hit tonight through tomorrow morning, but also talking about 48 degrees for Oceanside and 64 degrees as an overnight low for Borrego Springs. Still locked into the heat, I and mean, that's going to be west of the mount, or excuse me, uh, for the mountains as well as the desert. West of the mountains, a little bit of a hit when it comes to our temperatures. We had widespread 80s as well as some 90s that popped up earlier today. Daytime highs will take a bit of a hit. And about about 10 degrees. So you're talking about the 60s and low 70s returning right along the coast where we had lots of low 80s for today. Low 80s across inland regions, 82 degrees for Ramona, 80 degrees for Valley Center, but warmer tomorrow for the mountains as well as the desert as that area of high pressure moves towards the east. 95 degrees will be the high for Borrego Springs. So there is the high. Here's the area of low pressure and also another one towards the north of it. We're going to continue to have a troughing pattern over the west as we have a series of lows that move through. That's what's going to trigger that stronger onshore flow. It's going to knock our temperatures down at least through Thursday and also talking about gusty winds, especially for the mountains as well as the desert. And that's going to bring us a little bit cooler and then also more widespread gusts into the 20s, 30s and also the 40s. And then we have this area of high pressure. It's not a strong one, but a weak ridge that will move in and that will be by the weekend. So temperatures as they go a little bit lower into Thursday, you're looking at widespread 60s west of the mountains by Thursday. We start to bump those temperatures right back up again. Plenty of sunshine as we go into the weekend forecast back to 80 degrees for the inland valleys on Sunday. You're also looking at a return from the 60s on Thursday for the mountains back into the 70s by the weekend. And you take a little bit of a break. You get some 80s in the desert, but those 90s, they're right around the corner. Jake.